Hi, welcome to Tech Ranch, place where we learn and earn technical skills in the most efficient way. Let's make coding fun. Java game application development, word search. Today we are going to show you live demonstration of word search game application implemented in Java Swing graphical user interface API. Before we get into the demonstration, let's first see what are the requirements and the rules and how we can implement. Word search is a very simple one tier game application. Here we are going to have a grid of alphabets out of which we are going to search for the words listed below. And once you select the alphabets and letters and word search will be disable the word from the list. Now, these are the rules. Now, let's take a look how we can design and how we can implement it. Word search game application is a very simple game. So, we are going to have five Java classes out of which one will be your main. As we know, the Java compiler starts from the main method, the main launcher. The main class will initiate the board display constructor. And when it reached to the board display, here we are going to create a frame, set all the parameters for specific frame to have a all kind of graphical user interface component and a design of it. And once it is done, we are going to initiate the word search generator. The word search generator will simply jumble all the alphabets from randomly picked words from the dictionary or you can say it will just have all the A to Z words or you can say it will simply uh, jumbled or uh, shuffled all the 26 alphabets in a grid which is basically it's an array and all these arrays and all the letters or alphabets are in the form of the buttons so we are going to design the buttons later first we need to come up with the uh, backend programming where we are going to create a, a kind of a visual grid or an array of letters or alphabets and once this is done then we are going to create the word search generator frame in the buttons form so all the 26 alphabets in a random or shuffled form in the buttons will be created in word search generator now once the word search generator is done then we can jump into the dictionary the dictionary is nothing but the database where we are going to have all the words the meaningful words from a to z listed down here we have some samples they are not the entire oxford dictionary as such you can find some few words written out of which we are going to create the word search so all these we are going to pick up the words from the dictionary and jumbled all the letters of these words in some kind of machine like a generator and all those alphabets in the buttons form will be created in the letter buttons so this will display the array of random letters or alphabets for board in buttons a proper gear uh, it will be like a click button now once the buttons is created the, after that we need to have those words which actually is uh, picked up from the dictionary in the list so that user can find all these words in the word search great so we need to have the list of the words and display below the grid so that uh, the user can focus and find out the words the player so search for word out of the display alphabets grid, display the list of all the words, the meaningful words. You picked it from the dictionary. So this is what the design, it's very simple. You can have more uh, advanced features included in this game like uh, scores or timers or multiple players or deployed it online and uh, make it more interactive and responsive. Now let's take a look at the demonstration. So you can see here what uh, is this game, how it will look. You can see we can first have a welcome 
message box for the player where we are going to show the rules like welcome to TechCrunch World Games. This is just a message box that you can find it in J option panel and initiate it. So to play, find all the words listed on the bottom, select the words on the grid by clicking on the tiles. Tiles are nothing but the buttons. Now this grid will be open and here you can see when below we are listing all the words you have to find out in this grid. And when you click on these buttons and select the word, the word will be dis disabled here and this will be colored in different form, color in the blue color so it will uh, focus more that you have found this word now once you have found all the words it will uh, have a pop-up message for you saying congratulations you win and give an option if you want to quit or play again so this is what the uh, word search game created and implemented using swing graphical user interface it's very simple and one player game now let's take a look at the demonstration. So this is my Eclipse IDE and here is my word search game application. It's a simple Java application. So when you start implementing, you have to choose a Java project, new Java project. I have not created any package. It's just a few classes just to have a sample and tried ones. And you can find all my dictionary. So this is what the dictionary like all the a to z words you can find it here these are very simple ones. these are not the entire words but still i have got something from a to z words this is not the entire dictionary it's like just a sample of it and uh, this is my main java file from where i'm going to initiate the grid and creating the uh, game board so whenever we start the application, we have to start from the main launcher. So this is my main launcher. You can see here, this gives me the rules. And when you click OK, and here we have the our grid. Now we need to find out the words legals. Now we have to find out the words cogs, explain, kettle, scheduled, hostages, exceeded, sedator all these words we need to find so give it a try okay i found c o g so look this colored has changed and uh, the word is disabled this is how it's going to look next just keep it an eye on it you never know what word you can find okay if you do like this sometimes what happened people just uh, randomly select the word they are not sure of it so that's why we need to reset that process okay make sure that you player know so legals right so this is detail, uh, disabled. Now, sedator. And we have world. Just keep an eye which one it is. And uh, exceed it. You can see here. You can reset the size of the array of the grid but for that you need to change lots of things for example the array size you have to initiate uh, the array size or you can use the and i need to find out one more yeah there you go And it says you win, play again or quit. 
So play again will reset the entire board and uh, a quit will simply exit from the game. So like this. So this is what the live demonstration of word search game application implemented in Java Swing Graphical User Interface API. Word search game application can have some advanced features like you can add timers and scores. You can even add multiple player features and deploy it online uh, in a web server to make it online game and you can uh, integrate it in the android or any other uh, ios type of component it's very independent and a very lightweighted program this type of games used for vocabulary and uh, educational learning based games for any kind of concerns questions please feel free to post a comment post it in the comment section and for source code please email to techranch2019 at gmail.com Thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe and stay tuned for more upcoming interesting informative sessions. Let's make coding fun. Thank you.